Hi. Do you like crunchy foods? Do you like ASMR? Then we've got the thing for you. I'm Lena. I'm Kylie. And all of you will join us at a later time. Let's jump right into the video. Welcome back. Today we are going to be trying some um, some drinks. Um, so we got Pets, Pepsi. And then we got two kinds of bubble art. Right? This one's tropical pineapple and this one's blood orange. I don't like this one, but... I've never tried either of those. I haven't either. This is the one my mom likes. I like the blue kind, yeah, and have you guys, have you tried the new green kind? No. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's good. What is it, watermelon? Yeah, it's watermelon. Watermelon mm -hmm. lime. I like it. Okay, I guess we can start. Um, let's yeah, let's the start with open. the blood orange one here. And here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you more as we go. I'm just portioning it out. I don't know if you guys even like this. I'll just, just figure it okay. out. Here you go. It looks like orange pop. It smells good. Yeah, it's probably yeah. going to taste like orange pop. All right. <laughs> It does taste like orange <laughs> pop. <laughs> I like this one. It's a mingler. Mango mingler. Yep. Blood orange mango mingler. What do you think of it, Olivia? I, I, I mm -hmm. like it. It's decent. It's not the best one I've had, though. I like the dark blue one, but I don't yeah. know. All right. Did you like it? Don't you like the weather boy? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go in with the tropical one. <laughs> Alright, let me pop this bad boy open. You gotta finish it so that they don't mix. Ooh, that was satisfying. This I'll give fun. you more. Because there's a lot left, but. Ooh, <laughs> that's, that's an interesting color. <laughs> no, don't drink it yet. I'm not done filling I'm not, it. I'm not. Oh. <laughs> I'm just portioning. So let me just draw a little L on my cup so that we don't forget who's. Oh, you just got a lot. Oh. Everybody's got to have that much now. Okay. Okay, maybe I'll uh, take your cup. Right. Um, let's start. Smell test. It smells like pineapples. Yeah. I don't know, I can't smell it. <laughs> okay. Oh. I already drank this one this morning. What kind is that? Pineapple? Tropical pineapple. Tropical pineapple. Tropical it's got dreamer. Ap apple, pineapple, mango, and lime. Mm. Yeah, that's pretty good. Guys, I never liked, I don't want to hate something, so I never try a new one. So I just always drink the blue one. But this is good, so now I can drink those too. I like both of those. Yeah. And I yeah. tried the watermelon one. You know the karma drinks? Mm -hmm. I only like the pink one. So do I. Well, no, not the pink one, the red one. Because I, I haven't tried I haven't tried the other ones. I don't know. Isn't the pink one strawberry? I think it's lemonade. Strawberry. Yeah. Something like that. No. When you guys said karma, the first thing I thought of is just <laughs> it's karma is a bee. I should. Hold on. Give me a voice sound. <laughs> <laughs> What does she sound like? Do you want me to do I the dance? Know. I don't know the dance, but... Better. Anyways. Uh, you know number four. Wait, the, which one sounds like her? Not this one, apparently. <laughs> um, I don't know. Your hair slicked back because I can't. What is... Okay, right um... No. <laughs> it sounds like a little girl voice. I think that's the problem. Um. Hello. <laughs> okay. Eddie. Call me a bee. I should have known better. If I had a wish, I would have never left around. 
Oh. Why would you love when you feel the night twist? Karma is a bitch. And she's with you right <laughs> now. Oh, um, and then, what's the next part? I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I swore I did it all for fun and it meant nothing. I don't know what happened. happened. It I was know. a secret. Yeah. Is something, something to like keep it? That's how I know. Alright, let me drink the rest of this and then we can go in with the Pepsi. <laughs> I like this. Yeah, I I'll give it, fill your I, glasses because I'm I'm the mixologist. Not yet. We have to try the Pepsi. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Ready? We're all gonna crack at the same time. Ready? Wait, I'm not ready. Set, go. Oh my gosh! It smells. I know. Nothing. I was just gonna say that. I'm not oh, gonna be able to drink yeah. this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pour it into this cup and see if anybody wants it in the class. What the freak? <laughs> you can't shake it. I can shake it. This boy just exploded. <laughs> I don't even like Pepsi. I okay. just drink it. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna pour it into here. That's a good what idea. What the freak? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll ask him. Ian, do you want a Pepsi? Do you want some of this? Are you sure? Okay. Do you like Pepsi? You can have it. I'll come give it to you. You don't have to be in the camera. I'll come give it to you. Okay. <laughs> we'll give it to someone else. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Okay. Hey. Let, Let me see how much. You put so little in there. <laughs> <laughs> I had to burp. Hey. <laughs> Dr. Yeah. Dr. Pepper is much better. I just just remembered how much I hate this. <laughs> I checked and I still hate it. <laughs> it's disgusting. Yeah. Dr. Pepper is much better. Yeah, Dr. Right. Pepper is good. Let me put that to the side. Mm -hmm. Oh. Here. Now my freaking cup is contaminated. Guys, <laughs> 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 why does my voice sound like that? Because it's probably going on with hers. Because so is mine. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm loud. Alright, what color do you want? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, <it's> my Pepsi. <laughs> what color do you want? Um. Give me the orange one. When I do this, it sounds like a horror movie. So it's like you hear that little girl's voice in the background. <sighs> Wait. Mm -hmm. the, the laugh in the... Oh, the movie that I showed you. Lena, what movie? The Smile. laugh? No. The other one. The, the last in the, adventure? In the world, he's in the woods. The he's out there? Yeah. Or he's... He's out there, and they can do the, the, the laugh. I just, I just mixed these two. Oh. Interesting. I can okay. use that. That's actually really good. Let me use that to get all this stuff out of my car. Contaminated. It is contaminated. <laughs> That's mine. Hello. Can they talk? Hello. Hello, darkness. <laughs> um, what else can I say? Oh, I go out walking after midnight out in the moonlight. Just hoping you'd be somewhere out walking after midnight. Searching for me. I stop to see you with the moonlight. Crying on his pillow, maybe he's crying for me. <laughs> and as the sky comes blue, nothing is to me. I'm lonesome as I can be. <coughs> yeah. That was pretty.
pretty good. That was amazing. Good job. That was great. How do you like that? Why am I so loud? Here, let me turn you down. What? Did you hear? I'm like really loud. I don't know. I think it's because you were like, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm right here. <laughs> Okay, for some reason that voice really suits you. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know. I have a really high voice anyway, so it's just really... Yeah. I can't, like... Okay, anyways. I don't know what I was going to say. Do you like that? Mm-hmm. It's good. <laughs> Excuse me. I think whichever one has more. I can't see inside of them. Here, let me determine. It's definitely this one. There's more. I'll pour me some of this. So when me and my dad are in the car, and he like is, actually it's when my whole family's in the car. Um, so like when he gets out to fill gas, and then like he washes the windows. Like, you know that scrubber part where you scrub? And we go, and then when he scrapes it, he, we go. Tuesday, Thursday, Wednesday, Thursday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and a half. So technically we only have 15 days because we have two half days. Yeah, two half. Two half makes a whole. That was kind of like a transition. One plus one equals two. <laughs> two plus two equals four. <laughs> Why does it crack? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I can't turn my wrist though. <laughs> you don't have to be so loud about it. Anyways, what can we talk about? What has get, been going on recently? Nothing. None of us are on track, so we don't know what's going on. The track is... Do you guys remember last year when we, like, went to that track meet? When is that? Because I don't know where I go. Oh, the, the... Is it 281? 281? Is it that? The one in Huron? Yeah. I don't know. Why do you want to go to the Huron one? Because we're allowed to go. Well, last year they let us go. Yeah, like everybody went, so we didn't have to do school. Mm. That's only during the end of the season, so it's probably coming up soon. Probably in the next 15 days. They even let us go. They let us go on a fan bus. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I was in track, so I was there anyways. Oh, yeah. Okay, I have a big beef. Like with who? Well, not like a, with my whole family. Okay. And like everyone in the world. What's the beef? Okay, so I will burp one time, and my whole family will be like, "Ew, that's disgusting!" Like, shut up. No, it's not. Gentry will let out a huge burp, and then my dad will be like, "Good one." Is like, that a helicopter going by? You guys hear that geese? That's what somebody does when somebody lets out a toot. You guys hear those geese out there? <laughs> My dad always goes, do you smell smoke? And then everyone takes a big whiff and we're like, oh, damn. You get it? Yeah. Guys, <laughs> I'm so unfunny today. <laughs> yeah, you can do say that. Um... What did you guys do this weekend? 
breaking plans to pick up Rugger, my sister's dog, because she's going to be gone for three months because she's in the Air Force and she's flying somewhere else. She's supposed to be in a disclosed location, but she can tell us when she's there. And then she's going to, um, what do you call that place? Uh, Las Vegas. We went last year to go see her because she was there last summer. So we, my mom wants to see if we can go again. We walked 10 miles each day we were there. Jeez. Like, we walked in every hotel. And then we ate at this one spot, and it was chicken. We just ate chicken. The Marshalls? <laughs> Let me tell you about the Marshalls. We went to freaking Marshalls. <laughs> And it, it was like, it was so big. I couldn't even look through everything there. I'm pretty, like, I don't know how to explain it. It was just, it was like the size of Target. Hmm. Let me That's think. interesting. It was definitely not the size of Aberdeen. It was huge. And then we went to the M&M &M store. And yeah. Like, are we talking like Sioux Falls Target? Or like, no. bigger? No, Aberdeen. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it's as big as the Sioux Falls Target. Guys, I don't know the difference between Targets. I've only ever been to one Target. I don't go shopping. Isn't that weird? My mom loves shopping. My mom doesn't like shopping. My clothes. mom doesn't like shopping. She literally shops till she drops. I hate shopping <laughs> with my mom because she's... Oh, hey, mom, if you're watching this. Yeah. <laughs> she's probably not watching this. <laughs> Anyways. Um... She doesn't let me, like, pick out what I want to wear. My mom just literally... I don't know what she does. If I say I like something, she's like, Yeah, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> My mom's always like, Yeah, but... You're probably gonna... No, Mom. Stop. My mom doesn't like shopping with her kids because we take too long. Okay. Oh, my. my mom's the one who takes too long. I have a pet peeve with my mom. She always is like, yep, let's go. We got to get out the door. And then she like goes to look at something else. No, That's my I, dad. No, we will be like at my cousin's house. All right. And she will call us up from like being in the basement and be like, we have to go right now. And then she'll all of a sudden remember something and talk and talk and talk. And then we will sit there for like 20 minutes. And then we like try and go back downstairs. And she's like, no, we have to leave. And then she talks again. Literally, that's how my mom is. Excuse me. Anyways. My mom always tells me to be quiet, but then she's like always singing. She's like, <laughs> when she's like making I've noticed supper, that. Something, she's literally singing. I've <laughs> noticed that about your mom. She always sings. I know. Or well, she makes some kind of noise. There's <laughs> some girl. There's a girl in my church when she's eating. Like this. Is, like she's eating. <laughs> <laughs> it's so annoying. Have you guys been in the Shields in Minnesota? They're like, no. Guys, I've never been to any store in Minnesota. I'm going to Michigan with my cousin for Fourth of July. Um, Mexican radio. She didn't say Mexican. I had a dream. Oh no. That. Okay. I don't know what was going on, but I saw you somewhere who and i'm trying to remember her i was going and then like i got in a fight with someone and so then i like ran away from my house and i ended up like meeting you somewhere and you were with alexis i don't really know <laughs> what was going on can i tell you about that dream with my mom which one well it was pretty recently um so we were at like the grocery store in Redfield mm -hmm. and my mom was like she had some kind of poison or something like in this little bag and this old man walked by and sometimes he sniffed it somehow she sniffed it and he died <laughs> like he just fell over instantly so we had to cover the aisles like I don't know how we covered them but she we put him in a box and I, I don't know how we got him home, 
You know those like rolly carts you can get at Menards? You said you put them in a box? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> like just a plastic, bo- like a no, cardboard like a, box? Yeah, like a really long one. I don't know where we got it. But when I got home, so I have my closet. But behind my clothes, there was like a next room. What the? And, and wasn't that man was, back there? What? Wasn't the man in there? Yes, he was in the box in my <laughs> you room. Don't tell me about that. <laughs> um, one of my dreams that I've remembered for like ever. Oh, I have two of them. So this one guy, this chicken man. We were on top of this thing, on top of this big tower, and I was going climb to the top, climb back down. And we were gonna go home, and I climbed to the top, and this this chicken, like it was, he was dressed like Big Bird. <laughs> was throwing babies off of the top <laughs> of the thing. I'm not kidding, guys. And I sprint back down. Like, he tries to corner me, and I sprint back down. Probably fell down the stairs. I don't really know. Anyways, my mom is waiting, and I'm like, Mom, let's go. We gotta go. We gotta go. And, like, we are in the car, and we're driving, and we end up in Wall, South Dakota. And in Wall, yeah. um, we see him, and, like, he touches our window. So I'm like, mm. Mom, go. And so then, he was like, um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. And then we got to our house. And we, what the heck is this? Anyways, we got to my house, and then we were at my grandma's house. And my grandma was like this famous somewhere or something. And when she, um, she was like a famous singer, and when she, like, had had like, like, like overalls that were like, like famous, <laughs> and this chicken man shows up in the Okay, okay, and then we show up, and this chicken man shows up, and he has like this black bodyguards, like they're all just in all black, and they show up with like a party bus, and he grabs the overalls that are like super famous and then I try to catch him and his bodyguard spray spray silly string in my hair Kylie didn't you have like a dream about you yelling don't take my lemons no I said that at a hotel one time we were at a hotel and I like I was sleeping and I said don't put the lemons in my book bag oh my my cousin was staying at my house one time and she said I sat up like, I sat up when I was sleeping, and I was, like, mumbling something, and I just fell back down. Isn't that kind of scary? Okay, guys, so my other dream was when, um, so we were in this police station, and the police asked me, how old are you, and what is your name? I said, I'm Lena Puffer, and I'm seven years old. And... So they let me go, and the next day, they catch me again. I didn't even know what I was doing. And they were like, how old are you, and what is your name? I'm like, I'm Lena Puffer, and I'm seven years old. <laughs> so then I go to sleep, and the next day, I have the same, like, the same thing happens. And they call me in, and they're like, what's your name, and how old are you? I'm like, I'm Lena Puffer, and I'm seven. <laughs> and the fifth day, I come in, and I'm like, I'm Lena Puffer, and I'm seven. And grandma, my grandma, and my mom were standing at the end of the hallway, and they were like, the police were like, say it, ask goodbyes. And I said goodbye. <laughs> started randomly laughing and they threw me into this like manhole full of water like you know those manholes in the cities there was one of those in the police station and they threw me in there and there was this old lady and she was like trying to get me and I had to swim away from her and I woke up I had another dream too but (laughs) that's a lot of dreams that is one. Do you remember all your guys' dreams? A um, lot of them. I had one. I just can't remember what it was. It was about a snake. That's all I remember. Yeah, I had that chicken dream. And I also had the police dream. 
had a dream. You guys know Chucky? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I had a dream that he gave me a birthday cake for my birthday and he was like being all friendly. And then like I was about to eat my cake and he like stabbed me through my cake. <laughs> Did you guys know that you like, what? When you can't die in your dream? I because can't die in my dream? No, you can't die in your Why dream not? because the adrenaline in your head, like when you're seeing that, it's still producing adrenaline in your brain and it wakes you up before you die. I sometimes I wish like I knew what the rest of my dream was. I know. Like I Guys, sometimes when I, dream, I, so I try to fall back asleep. That's what I do. When I was in my dream, I can tell myself that I'm dreaming. Isn't that weird? Like, I can't do that. I think my brain like half wakes up and tells myself that I'm dreaming. I always because that's like in up, real life. I wake up and I'm like freaking sweaty. It's I can't so remember. It's like I don't know if I wake up. But, like, towards the end of my dream, like, I'm still dreaming, but I feel awake. Yeah, my, um, that's because your REM sleep is stopping. Yeah. I, do you know, like, how you can videotape what you're saying? Like, there's an app where you can mm-hmm. videotape what you're saying in your sleep. I kind of want to do that, but I feel like they're going to track my voice. <laughs> so I'm kind of scared. I had a dream. That I was at my dad's house, like when I ended at my dad's house, and like nobody was home besides me and my sister. And there's like this truck pulled up to my dad's house, and we didn't know who it was. And so we like try to lock all the doors, and you you know how my dad has like two doors, so we try to lock like the one on the side of his house, like where the like the one that we don't go through. And like these men like pulled up and like started like, and the one door wouldn't lock, and so like we just left it. And, we went to go hide and um they came into the house and were like talking to us and then they like tried to kidnap us and so like we got on the four-wheeler and then we started like driving away to huron because we knew our way to huron and they're like chasing after us um my sister woke up and she was like screaming and crying because she had a dream and like these wolves like were chasing her and she was running away from them and like they bit off her fingers (laughs) what the i had a dream like it was a zombie apocalypse and well i don't know what to call it but they killed my parents with this really long (laughs) knife like a machete no it was just like a sword a super long knife like like a, like a katana well i know you don't understanding how long it is it, so you know the trees beh- <laughs> behind the cows like mm-hmm. they're not the trees behind me they're the trees in front of me yeah and uh it, they were like hiding in those trees and then they like, their sword reached my house. <laughs> so they would swing the sword around. And for some reason, I think I went to my... It was, like, a long time ago, so I went to... I ran to my grandma's house. Well, no, I was on my way to my grandma's house or something. And then the zombies caught me. They didn't kill me, but they turned me into one of theirs. And I was just there. But I was so scared that there were zombies in the tree that night. And they were going to kill me with a really long sword that I went to go sleep with my mom and dad. I don't know why I was so scared. Have you guys ever seen the Robert movie? It's what? like Chucky and Tiffany's no. kid. No. I've never seen yeah, Chucky. No. No. Absolutely not. The one movie that I saw, it was not bad. But I hate that horror movies don't have bad or good endings. Also, that one thing, what's that one show? The other one I watched, Smile. So, I think I told this last week. But, oh my god, it was scary. What? You were going to say something about a movie. No, I wasn't. Anyway, yeah. Um, once, the one time I was, um, just, um, well, I'm just going to tell this really quick. The one time I saw the f- like a smidge bit of a uh, scary movie, my sister had turned it on and I was like six years old. And <sighs> these people were on the beach. And they were like, it was really dark and like gloomy. But it wasn't like dark outside. It was just like a scary vibe. I don't know how to put it. But they were like on their way home and when they got home 
like there was another them like that would shadow everything they did but they didn't want to do that anymore so they like they were torturing them and they had white eyes What's so the? this little boy was hiding in the closet but they came like they found him his shadow found him and they tied everybody to chairs and they were like we don't want to be your shadow anymore and i still think of that because like what if i have a shadow and like because one He's time right back there this little girl <laughs> the mom now but when she was little she met her shadow when she was out riding her bike home and she was like she she was nice to him she was like hey and nothing happened but she was like she kind of looks like me but when she gets older yeah i can i shut the tv off before i found out if they died or not mm. but it was really scary well i think that's all we've got today bye bye